All right, we have Archie and his week two recap. Starting this week, similar to how I did last week, so I'm going to start by charging my clicker. Good boy. We're going to move right into him following my food lure. Good boy. Hey, good job, buddy. Be moving. I don't need you to offer me sits yet. continue tossing those get it cookies and then practicing calling his name as soon as he turns towards his name that's what I'm clicking get it Archie good boy bud The new thing with our hand target this week, we are starting to fade the use of food. Um, so that first hand target, I still had food in my hand like we did last week. But then my second hand target, no food in hand, I just presented my flat palm. Touch. And as soon as I feel his nose, I'm still going to click and give him the food. Touch. What a good boy. for our sit, similar to the hand target we just did, um, I'm also trying to fade the food for that. So the first one, I did use food to lure him into position. And then that second one, I had no food in my hand, and I just used my hand signal with a verbal to ask him to get into position. You good boy. And then as soon as he was in his sit, get it. Uh, I still clicked and I still fed him a piece of food. in position pause came up a little bit um, just make sure that he's back in his nice sit before you give him his reward cookie you ready get it where'd it go well you lose that get it cookie then all right just getting the treats ready the new position that we worked on this week is a down um, so while he's in his nice sit food at nose level and together we're going to go down to the ground good boy as soon as i see that his back end has hit the ground and those front elbows are also on the ground that is what we're going to click and feed down good boy a little hard to tell with that one because he kind of crunched himself into a weird ball good boy a follow-up cookie for staying in that down. Ready? Get it! Sit. 
down. Good boy. I like it. Good job. Don't you automatically lay down. There you go. Down. Very good boy. Follow up cookie. One more follow up cookie. So we're going to be done with this one. Good job. You got it. Oh, you let it go. Good boy. You gotta bite it. You gotta bite it. What's that? Get it. You know, you just gotta do your itches. That's okay. That's okay, right? Um, so the next thing we worked on, something new, is luring him in and out of his, his kennel. Um, so let me get some cookies ready for that. Good boy. Come here, handsome. What are we doing next? As soon as he got four paws in, that's when I clicked. The cookie was already in there. He's just struggling to find it. Boy. I'm going to follow up with a cookie right inside the kennel to kind of keep him in there. Um, and I dropped that one. But then we'll use a release cookie to release him from the kennel. Kennel. Good boy. Yeah. So how that follow-up cookie looks is I'm going to get the cookie right in front of his nose to kind of hold him back in the kennel. Okay. And then I'll use that okay release word to get him out. Are you going to go around? There's nothing back there. Oh my goodness. And then the next step to the crate. Right here. Ready? Kennel. closing the door, so I'm going to click and then open and feed him for that. So click once the door is shut, he's staying nice and calm. And then by opening the door to feed him, we're teaching him to stay in there as the door is opening. Okay. And then I'm going to use that release cookie to get him out of there. Yeah, you know you're a cute boy, don't you? Ready? Kennel. It's in there, I promise. Good boy. Here you go. <clears throat> So with the mat this week, we've reviewed uh, step one and we also introduced step two. Um, now step two to the mat, the mat is going to stay stationary. And my goal is going to be that Archie offers me a sit um, before I click and feed. Oh, you, you finally found your get it cookie. Archie, psst, psst. go to your mat. So warming him up with step one. Four paws over. 
Good boy. Step one, I'm going to move the mat. Go your mat. Like that, good boy. And on this time, we're going to keep the mat stationary. Okay. Good, buddy. Come here. Come on. Yeah, good job. Good boy. Yes, good job. You're doing great. Okay. Boy. All right. We're almost done. Awesome. So the next thing we're going to work on is going to review the handling exercises that we worked on last week. This week my goal is to build some duration with the handling. Um, so with the amount of time that I have my hands on each body part. Here you go, free cookie again. Jeez. So I want to show him that I have the handful of cookies to start. Once he knows they're there, he's sniffing and attached to them. Okay. Yes. Um, I started with the restraint under his belly. This week I added duration to that and some pressure. Yes. Good. So with his tail, um, increase the amount of time that I have his tail held and lifted. The ears, adding some massage. Yes. Um, so that adds the manipulation part as well as some duration. I know, you weren't quite attached yet, I'm sorry. Yes. Good boy. Okay. Okay. Next thing is going to be working on the paws. I kind of want you to face this way. Here, food, follow. Good job. Um, so starting with holding the paw, I'm going to add some little, little pinches, pressure, finding the nail itself. Yes, good boy. Here, I have food still. Yeah, good boy. Yes, good job. Yes, good boy. <laughs> what did I do? There you go. Finding the nail. Yes, good boy. And then really just adding in the movement, the manipulation of as if we we're going to trim his toes. Um, the other new part to our handling this week is introducing some grooming tools. Today I have the brush. Um, so with the brush, I'm going to use the flat side versus the bristle side this week. Flat side is going to glide down his back. Good boy. We also want to practice in other areas where he'll be getting brushed, so his chest. Good job, handsome. And then behind his ears and up towards his face. Come on, you can eat that right there.
um, was getting Archie in his harness. So we have one leg in, his face is so tiny, but the harness is so big. <laughs> Good boy. Um, and then we'll clasp him in on the other side and we'll set you down. Good job. And then while he's in his harness, we just want to work on getting some movement. So I'll toss some of those get it cookies. <laughs> he's currently frozen. <laughs> Have him follow the food lure. And he's get it. Yeah, good boy. Archie. Yes, good boy. Archie. Good job, buddy. Touch. You're blowing me off. You came over. Good boy. Um, the hand target is a really nice movement exercise. Um, going at that distance is new to him. So when he first came over, he's like, I don't know what you want. Um, but then he did put his nose on my palm. What's happening over there? Archie! Puppy! Good boy. Okay, what's this? What's this? Yeah. Good job. Good job, bud. And that is it for Archie's week two recap. Good job, puppy. Yeah, I'm